In this video, I'm going to discuss how to automatically play a video in PowerPoint. Now, I'm in PowerPoint right now giving this presentation. Let's jump over to the uh, let's jump over to the slide creation interface. Here I am in PowerPoint, and I'm going to create a brand new blank presentation. Then I'll select everything on the page, and I'll delete it. Now, I actually want two pages. So what I'll do is, in the navigation pane here, I'll right-click, and I'll say Duplicate Slide. So I have two blank slides now. Now, on the second slide, I'm going to come here, and I'm going to insert a video for us to play with. And I'm going to get this from stock videos. Now, I'm running Office 365, which means that I get access to stock video and stock images as part of my license. So, And this is really convenient. So this one I kind of like. It's uh, graduates throwing their caps up in the air. And if I want to insert that, I just double click on it. Now, let's go ahead and play this slide presentation from the beginning. Slideshow from beginning. You can see here's our blank slide. By the way, these controls in the lower left, if you're recording the screen and you don't want to see them, let me show this to you again. Slideshow from beginning. Look at the lower left of the screen. See those controls? If I hit Control H, they disappear. So that's usually the first thing that I do. And my cursor disappears too. Now, I can click and the video automatically plays. And the controls aren't displayed for the video. And that's the end of the presentation. So you can see the video is automatically playing. Now, let's click on the video and go to playback and see what options we have here. And here you can see the start is set to automatically. We can also make it in click sequence so that it goes in the normal cliffs click sequence of uh, animations and slide actions. So let's do this and we'll say slide or slideshow from beginning. Here's our blank slide. We'll control H to get rid of those controls in the lower left. And then I'll hit left or I'll hit cursor or I'll click rather. And you notice the video isn't playing until I click. And then I click again and the presentation is over. So that's your controls here on playback on how to start a video automatically. Now in my case, videos automatically play anyway. And let me show you one other thing while I'm here. I'm going to do a slideshow from beginning. Now if I don't hit Control H, notice that I get this uh, play thing here for a while, and I don't want to see that on the screen. So another thing that you can do is come here to the slideshow and you can say, show media controls. You can get rid of that. That will get rid of that little play bar for the video on the second slide. Now, if I come here, or rather if I show from beginning, I still get those, but I don't get that play bar. So if you don't want to see the play bar on your video, then just come here to the slideshow options to set up and unclick show media controls. And remember, just click on the video and you'll get playback options for the video. And in playback, you can set start to on click automatically and when clicked on. I think that's very similar to in sequence. Let's try a slideshow from the beginning. Ah, it doesn't actually play at all when you click, when you select when clicked on. So what you want is in click sequence to click on it and play, automatically to automatically play it, and when clicked on to not play it at all.